Jada Pinkett Smith was reduced to tears after listening to one of R. Kelly's alleged victims share her story. Lisa Van Allen claimed in the docuseries, Surviving R. Kelly, she was just 17 when she began a long-term relationship with Kelly, who insisted on having threesomes with Allen and an allegedly underage girl. Allen recalled the relationship in depth during an appearance on Smith's Facebook series, Red Table Talk, where they both became emotional discussing the painful memories. I'm just so sorry, Jada said during a tearful moment, reaching for several tissues. Sorry you didn't get it sooner. I'm not going to cry. Alan wiped away her own tears before lightening up the mood by revealing she had long wished to speak with Smith, even before the documentary, Surviving R. Kelly, ever aired. I said I love that show Red Table Talk, it's so real and draw. Before the show even aired or anything, I've been saying, I want to talk to Jada on Red Table Talk. I know she'll understand, I want to talk to her. Alan went on to say the reaction has been so different this time around. I feel blessed, I feel like I'm a vessel, you know what I mean? To speak out for other young girls. We've always been told, you don't talk about that. You don't tell our business. My mom had a hard time dealing with this, because we had to really deal with ourselves, her reaction on how she felt on her role, my role. Alan is the woman who claims to have stolen the sex tape which allegedly featured Kelly and a 14-year-old girl. The tape led to Kelly's arrest on charges of child pornography, followed by a trial in 2008. In the end, Kelly was acquitted by a jury of his peers. Alan described in detail how their relationship unfolded, alleging they began having threesomes after he claimed to have never had one before. She agreed to the encounters because we were together and I was living with him. But once they had their first threesome, her concerns grew after he continued pushing for more and more. He wanted another one, and another one, then that's when it was like, uh-oh, she said. That is when Smith stepped in and defended Alan. People need to remember that Lisa, you were a child on that tape, and I think people got that twisted. The idea that those were two minors, she said. Alan has previously stated she was unaware of how young the third partner was only learning the girl was 14 when she revealed Kelly would be buying her a car for her 16th birthday. She said she started questioning things once she learned how old the girl was. Now realizing she had put Kelly's needs before her own, Alan says she advises young women to love themselves first. That was the problem, Alan said. I was putting his feelings before mine. I didn't care that it bothered me. I didn't care that I cried and that I was upset and that I had to share someone I love with other women. I wanted him to be happy. The backlash against R. Kelly has intensified following the release of a new Lifetime docuseries, Surviving R. Kelly, which explores the allegations of sexual misconduct involving women and underage girls leveled against the singer. Kelly has denied all of the accusations made against him. 